offers us a fresh start. But if we don't know where we came from, how will we know where to go? No cap is rolling. Sight. One, two, three. A rough overview of Cinematics Pipeline is they get a script, voice actors come in and, and do their magic. The cameras are usually defined at that point, and that's when we do the mocap shoot. We have work to do. Basically, mocap is creating the foundation animations on all of these characters. So we have these markers that are all wired up inside of the suit, and it records our skeletons, and our skeletons are then puppeted onto our characters. I had to see it with my own eyes. I have a suit and Tom has a suit. I've been doing emotes and he's been doing almost all the cinematics and the NPCs content. We have to leave. Oh, we've got it, Tom. That's awesome. Yeah, we got it, man. Thank you. When we had to transition into working from home, there's nobody really to interact with, and that has been the biggest challenge. Okay, audio rolling. You have to be more imaginative and creative with your surroundings. One of the cinematics, we have eight characters in a shot, and me as the sole actor in that was super complicated because you have to keep in mind the people in front of you, the people behind you, and all the interact points. So I built these props that uh, <laughs> one of them is an old vacuum cleaner, the other one is a gigantic tube that, uh, that I found somewhere in the, the recesses of my garage. <laughs> These are the prop actors that I've been sharing the stage with for the cinematic shoots. They're all about the same eye line. Uh, they're easily marked up so I can see where they're looking at. And uh, one of them even won an Emmy. Yeah, I have the same issue as like any of those types of emotes that are like multiple people. It's just like you need to remember where they are. So like the hug emote, like I try to get my dog to come up and like you know, hug my dog. Sometimes I use the pillow, sometimes I would stack a whole bunch of boxes and try to hug that. So it's been challenging, but it's also been fun because at two o'clock in the morning, I can just get into the suit and capture something if I have a really good idea. And cut. Perfect. The really cool thing about mocap is it's getting all the nuances of the actors so our characters feel more lifelike. I'm excited to see just how the players react to it. It's the reason why I go in and play the game is because I just want to go around and see everybody interacting with each other. I love that about our game. You were right. Three, two, one.